Hello students, welcome to Shirtback Academy. In our lesson today, we're going to be covering section 2.6 in the ITF Plus course. The topic for this lesson is common computing devices. Let's begin. Our first device type is smartphones. Smartphones are mobile devices that provide communication features such as voice and text, email, and video recording. Smartphones have screen sizes that are three to six inches diagonally. Smartphones use security features such as pin numbers, swiping codes, or facial and fingerprint recognition. Smartphones allow a user to download applications and use the device for file storage. Some common smartphone brands include Android, iPhone, Samsung, and Huawei. Tablets are computers with touchscreen capability and built-in keyboards. Users can use tablets for drawing and design applications. The most common tablet operating systems are Android, Apple's iOS, Google's Chrome OS, and Microsoft Windows OS. Tablets are larger than smartphones. They have screen sizes that are at least 7 inches diagonally. Tablets include recording features for video, streaming media, and cameras. Laptops are mobile computer devices that provide most of the same functions as a desktop PC. Laptops can connect to the internet through 802.11 wireless and wired ethernet. Newer laptops may require an adapter for wired ethernet, however. The most popular laptop operating system is Microsoft Windows. Microsoft Windows appears on many vendors' laptops as the base operating system. Other common laptop operating systems include Apple's Mac OS and Linux. Laptops share several similar connector slots for peripheral devices. Common connector slots include USB, analog audio headsets, power cables, and video connections such as HDMI and VGA. Desktop workstations are traditional tower computers. They're used primarily in office and home setups. Peripheral devices connect to the desktop by cable connections to the PC tower unit. Desktop PCs contain all the essential computing components including the motherboard, expansion bus, RAM memory, video cards, and cooling fans. Desktop PCs will have many different connector types for video and storage peripherals, including USB, optical discs such as CD and DVD, and video connections such as VGA and HDMI. Servers are devices that allow multiple users on a network to share data and application resources from a single place. Clients are the devices that have authorized access to the server. They can access all the data and services that are stored on the specific server. Some common server types we see are file servers, email, web, database, and print servers. Client server connections are when the user is accessing the server. Server-to-server -server communications are data communications between two servers only. Gaming consoles are devices that output video signals and images so that one or more people can play video games. Controllers are the devices that allow the player to operate within the gaming environment. Two common form factors of gaming controllers are joysticks 
and gaming pads. Gaming consoles have data storage and provide 802.11 wireless internet. Gaming consoles can also provide other features such as playing DVD or Blu-ray discs. Internet of Things is abbreviated as IOT. Internet of Things is a wireless data standard that's used between computers, mechanical devices, and digital machines. IOT devices communicate with each other automatically over a wireless connection. There is no manual administration of IOT devices. Internet of Things is commonly used in areas such as remote health monitoring, home security and appliances, and agricultural farming. Home automation is the ability to control all of our security, lighting, and appliances from a remote location. Many home automation systems have mobile applications that can control settings over remote internet connections. Home automation uses what's called the ISM band. ISM stands for Industrial Science and Mechanical. It's a lower frequency that's used by home systems with Internet of Things devices. Using the lower frequency ISM band allows devices to communicate without interference. Some common home automation systems include Ring, Zigbee, Z-Wave, and Ant Plus. IP cameras are digital video cameras that use the internet protocol to record and send image data. IP cameras require no local recording device. They are used primarily in modern surveillance systems. IP camera data can be stored locally on a network or remotely in cloud storage. IP cameras can be compatible with both wired Ethernet and 802.11 wireless internet connections. Medical devices are mobile technology that can monitor certain health and body measurements. Medical devices are frequently wearable technology. Medical devices will use both an 802.11 wireless and Bluetooth signal connections. OLED is for organic light emitting diode. OLED is a technology used in modern medical device display screens. It does not require a power supply, but generates light through organic compounds. Medical devices can store locally both our fitness and our nutrition data. It's a common feature that we can use for monitoring and reviewing our health. That will conclude this lesson. In the next lesson, we will cover section 2.7 of the ITF Plus course, Basic Networking Concepts. If you have any questions about the contents of this lesson, please review the course notes and exam objectives from section 2.6. We thank you for following along in the video. We will see you in the next one. Enjoy the rest of your day, everybody.